Alright, what's up guys? It's Super here and welcome back to another Mother Box opening video. And as you guys see here, I stacked up on as many Platinum Mother Boxes as I could. And I'm probably going to add a couple extra that I have on my Xbox One account after these initial ones. Probably without commentary and I might not even show it unless I get something good. Um, but I'm here on my PS4 account. The Sub-Zero Tower finally went live for Injustice 2, so I was able to... Play with Sub-Zero, get a bunch of gear, complete the tower, and grind for mother boxes while earning Sub-Zero gear. Having my AI play the multiverse over and over and over and over again. Um, so I'm here. 34 platinum mother boxes is a lot. And I also have 34 bronze, 9 silver, 6 gold, 2 diamonds, and a couple of guild mother boxes. So here we go. Let's not waste any more time. Of course, I could do an elongated intro now because... It's so much faster actually going through the mother boxes, you know, decoding them. It's just one button away. Um, but as you guys see here, I'm, I'm happy that I'm getting Sub-Zero gear. Back-to-back -back mother boxes, Sub-Zero gear. That means that my character is more preferred now than it was before. Because, of course, all I've been doing is having my AI play the um, Sub-Zero multiverse event. So, you guys know the deal. Uh, I'm not going to show any gear unless it's, uh, it's an epic ability, epic gear, or a shader most of the time that's how i do it um because if i would show every single piece of gear this video would probably be an hour long and don't worry i do have a epic gear showcase for every character coming up very very soon on my xbox one account because ooh, we got the luchador bane shader is this the best bane shader yes it is this is actually my personal favorite i think this is the bane, uh, best bane shader let me know in the comment section which one you guys think is the best. I think this one is the best one, especially with a couple of different masks. Bane looks awesome in this one, um, the Luchador one, so happy about that. Um, but in the process of just grinding out different, uh, you know, multiverse worlds, trying to get as much epic gear as I could for Sub-Zero on my Xbox One account, I managed to get so many awesome pieces of gear for other characters. And that's a cool thing about, you know, just having your AI grind for Platinum Mother Boxes in different multiverse worlds. Because you're guaranteed at least two epic pieces of gear unless you're very unlucky and you get only one. Um, but that's like the fastest way to get epic gear for your characters. And I got in a bunch of cool stuff that I didn't even know I had. Like, I went through a couple characters here. Oh, finally some epic gear. Epic legs for Green Lantern. It's cool that it's an epic, uh, you know, it's like a full epic gear set. I don't have too many of those completed. I think I only have, like, one, but it's only a two-piece epic gear set. <laughs> so it doesn't really count. Um, but, I, for example, I got the Red Sun Superman, you know, crest. I didn't even know I had it. I'm like, what the hell? I keep, did I get this throughout the process of just, you know, grinding out for these Platinum Mother Boxes? I guess I didn't check, right? Because <laughs> I was so focused on getting as much Sub-Zero gear as I could. And I'm very happy with the Sub-Zero gear that, I, that I've that i gotten on my Xbox One account. I have a, a bunch of cool stuff, including the classic Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3 slash Mortal Kombat Trilogy Ninja Mask, which is... My absolute favorite piece of Sub-Zero gear. But here we have some extra Joker stuff. And I do have a lot of like cool stuff on my PS4 account. But since I have been playing so much on my Xbox One account because of Sub-Zero. Um, just because like the way the marketplace... Oh, I actually kind of like this a lot. The way the marketplace works for uh, Xbox One. Like they, they updated right at midnight like 9 p.m pacific time it gets updated and the dlc characters are available so i always download them first on xbox one it's just because xbox one updates their you know stores a lot quicker than ps4 does so i get like a huge head start on my xbox one account and then it only makes sense to keep playing on the account that you have like the best looking gear for just to you know keep the videos interesting i was able to make Woo, a ton of videos with Sub-Zero, man. It was like a Sub-Zero channel for a bit. Ooh, I got two pieces of epic gear in one gold 
Guild Mother Box. Look at those feet. Look at those feet. Those are the feet of a god. And I got this right here. Coincidentally enough, uh, the Staff of Grayson ability, I actually got it from a Gold Guild Mother Box. Um, so, funny enough that I got like two pieces of epic gear in one Gold Mother Box. I guess you, it's very lucky to get Gold Mother Boxes for the Guild Mother Boxes. You get, you get some good stuff there, I guess. Alright, here we go. See, so yeah, as you guys see, right off the bat, too, unless you're very unlucky and you get one. Um, but two is the common, you know, uh, amount that you're going to get for Epic Gear on Platinum Mother Boxes. Got some more Aquaman stuff. I'm trying to build a ladies Aquaman. Shirtless Aquaman. Creeping Predator. Ooh, awesome. I got all epics uh, because all abilities are epic, so... The ability plus these three things, it's cool. I always like that. Dexstar and his mohawk. Got another Bane mask, let's see. Oh, I did not have this one on this account. Very, very happy I got it. Sweetness. That actually uh, is a really good mask for the luchador color that I got. Wow, this looks awesome. I guess I don't really check the accessories too much for, for most characters. So seeing it like this close it looks awesome. Nice. We're doing good so far. Already happy with uh, what the luck that I've been getting so far. Alright, looks like I have uh, overflowing Scarecrow gear. Have to clear that up. Haven't played with Blue Beetle in a while now that I'm thinking about it. Just got Blue Beetle stuff. Dark side legs. Dark side definitely has one of the weakest gears in the game. Like, you can't really get too much variety with this gear. The only one that I like really is like the uh, the corrupted, cracked face look. I really like that. But other than that, like he pretty much looks the same everywhere else. And Harley is the opposite. Harley has some of the best gear in the game. But I believe I did have that already. Some Dr. Fate legs. Ooh, nice. This is actually a variety that I didn't have. I do recognize the, you know, the onks on the shins, but I did not have uh, this version of the boots. Wonder Woman stuff. Yeah, I, I have a ton of Wonder Woman stuff because when they put out her multiverse event where you could get the, uh, the Wonder Woman movie gear, you know, I, I was just pretty much like grinding, grinding for that multiverse. And I, I do believe this is the straight up classic pants, like the, the default classic pants for Harley with no extra like grenades or anything like that. This is a good, you know, good pants to complete the uh, classic look for her. Some arms. Ooh, I actually like this. Yeah, I don't have too much gear for a blue beat on this account, so anything is good. All right, so far, no Sub-Zero gear. No Sub-Zero epic gear. But we still got a lot to go. All right, could I zoom out? Oh, no, I can't zoom out on this one, only on the uh, customization. Can't really see the difference. All right, nice gold. Captain Cold Torso, level three, Captain Cold. None of this matters to me because I only use Mr. Freeze. Only Mr. Freeze. That's it. Nothing else. Whoops, I forgot you could just press square. <laughs> I'm so used to doing it the old way. Um, Epic Dark Side. Has a new belt. And like I mentioned, can't really tell too much of a difference. Good old Dark Side with crap gear. <laughs> Ooh, damn, that looks like it's fit for a king. That really, really looks like it's fit for a king. Razor wire wraps. Have to make sure that I get this from the uh, extra inventory. Swampy. Damn, look at the stats on that. That is a really, really uh, high strength 
Those combos are gonna do some damage. All right. Not too much Sub-Zero stuff, but then again, this isn't really a you know quest for Sub-Zero gear. That was more like at the beginning of the game or at the beginning of the Sub-Zero release. This is just more of a mother box opening video. Hopefully I get some cool stuff. I got the Mark 11 gauntlets, which I did have already. I do have a good amount of Batman gear here. Not as much as Xbox One, but I feel like Batman just is one of those default characters that you get a ton of gear for just because there's a ton of Batman gear. All right, see, as you guys see here, this is a slight different variation of these specific boots for Dr. Fate. Have got one uh, similar to those, but they're not exactly the same. Some grod legs. All right, let's move on here. The scarab. Um, I actually like the other one a little bit more. The one has like like the neon lights look to it in the middle. It has like a curve. Ooh, nice! Finally, we got some epic Sub Zero stuff. We got some. We got the blade. Ooh, I really like the spikes on the hammer. You guys check that out. The spikes on the hammer look really really cool. No pun intended, of course, <laughs> but I don't even have this on my Xbox One account, so that's awesome that I got it here. Belt of the Cape Crusader. It's shiny. All right, let's see. Forgot to laugh. This sounds familiar. I've gotten this multiple times. Many, 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 many times. Chest. Okay. All right, I like it. Unless you have a hoodie on, I'm probably not going to use you, though. <laughs> I think a lot of people want that green arrow hoodie gear, right? Am I alone on this? I think a lot of us can agree that green arrow should have gear where he has the hoodie on. Maybe they're saving it for, uh, like, a CW show premiere skin. Something like that. I don't know. He has to have it, though. All right, I have these. Some more Scarecrow stuff. I'm very surprised that I'm getting a lot of Scarecrow gear here. I already had that one. Because Scarecrow on this account, I, I... Ooh. So, this is a little bit different than the one that I have. The one that I have is, is just, like, plain black. This one, you have some gems on her chest. It's a little bit brighter than the other one that I have. Cool. Plague Doctor. Yeah, I have this one already. Doesn't take away the fact that it still looks cool. You know what I just noticed right now? I got that rare piece of uh, gear for... Those are pretty nice. Got the spikes at the end right there. I got this piece of rare gear for Red Hood, and I just noticed that I really have not gotten too much gear for Red Hood, surprisingly. Gotta get on that. Blood Money Mask. How does this look? Oh, I already have one that looks like this. There's a couple of ones that look similar, but they're not. But I'm pretty sure I have that one. Some more Scarecrow stuff. The game wants me to play Scarecrow. Okay, game. I'll play some more Scarecrow in the future. Oh, I like the green in the middle. Wonder if that changes colors. It probably does with, you know, different shader. Damn, all these epics and I'm not getting any Sub-Zero stuff. I know I said I didn't, I didn't really care about getting Sub-Zero stuff, but I kind of do. A little bit, just a little bit. Oh, yeah, a cap. They gave him a cap before they gave him his hoodie. Yeah, good choice. Good choice. Ooh, this looks like it would match really well with the uh, other, you know, king armor that I got earlier today. Earlier today earlier in the video I should say yeah Harley's legs I do have that recognize the name damn more scarecrow guys holy crap this is the scarecrow show right here so many scarecrow pieces it's crazy speaking of Red Hood I just got an epic Red Hood gun okay I will take any epic Red Hood stuff because I don't have another epic Red Hood gun okay like I mentioned I'll take any Red Hood 
epic gear that I could get. Because I really don't have that much. Not even on my Xbox One account. But I do have, like, cooler stuff on my Xbox One account. Just because, like I mentioned before, I got Red Hood early. Or not early, but I got Red Hood before the PS4 guys got it. Just because of the way the Xbox updates their stuff. There's one really cool chess piece that I've seen or that I saw the AI play with earlier today that doesn't have a cape, but it looks really like, uh, like it looks, I don't know how to explain it. It looks more like a Robin, Robin gear. It doesn't have like the Nightwing, you know, like cross or crosses like arrow pointing down. It looks like very, very tight, but he doesn't have a cape. I think that gear looks awesome. You guys probably have no clue what the hell I'm talking about, but I picture it in my mind. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I remember it. All right. Batman utility belt. Pretty plain and simple on this one. Robin sword. Yeah, I have a lot of Robin swords, actually. I have a lot of uh, swamping clubs as well. I like this one. Nice blade. No cape, no cape, no cape. Actually, I think I have both of the no cape Black Adam gear, so don't really need a third unless there's actually a third. I don't need a repeat though. Yeah. Yeah. From the deep. What is this? Uh, creating an upward strike underneath his opponent. Meter burning calls down lightning that launches the opponent. Oh, you know what's funny? If from the Deep was actually the name of his uh, tentacle strike from the first Injustice game. Like, tentacle strike is exactly from the Deep from Injustice 1, where, you know, the octopus comes up and launches your opponent. It's funny that they actually kept the name but switched the move or the name to a different move which is an ability which is similar to the tentacle strike you know it's just water comes from underneath and lightning strikes down i might have to do that for a video check out how that looks i'm surprised it was called from the deep though that's for sure right three more here or two more now I can never complete this epic gear set for Supergirl. Never. I still, I think it's only a three piece epic gear set and I can't complete it. Same thing for the, uh, same thing for the Superman uh, House of L epic gear set where you get the blue, the blue heat vision. I still have not completed it yet and I only need the head. All right, last platinum here. This is a hoodie one, right? Oh no, this is not a head. This is just looks the same, just the, the belt changes a little bit. And then we got some Aquaman. Shirtless, please, shirtless. Oh, damn. No shirtless for me. All right, so let's move on here to the final two, which are diamonds. Ooh, that was a lot. And for characters, I do not want gear for. <laughs> Typical, 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 typical. Uh, I already have like Dr. Fate gear that I like. Uh, there isn't many gear pieces that change them that, that much. And I have a shit ton of Green Lantern gear, like a ridiculous amount of Green Lantern gear. And Atrocitus, uh, I have a bunch of arms and head pieces as well. All right, last one, boys. God damn. Damn it. Uh, a bunch of just a bunch of gear for characters that I kind of haven't played in a bit, man. Isn't it supposed to be preferred characters? I, I mentioned at the beginning, like, oh, it's a good sign that I got two Sub Zero pieces of gear in back to back mother boxes. And it, like, went not even downhill, it went on like a bungee jump, but the bungee jump cord ripped midway down so it just went down and splat on the ground because i didn't <laughs> i only got one piece of epic sub-zero gear 
And I didn't get too much gear that I'm really interested in, to be honest with you guys. But that's going to be the end of the PS4. I'll be back with the Xbox One if I get anything. If not, the video will end here, and I will see you guys next time. What's going on? It's Super here, and thank you for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you guys subscribe if you are not already. Also, check out any of these videos linked at the top. Thank you for watching, and I will see you guys next time.